All right, what's happening? A little quick booze review out here on the lake today. Beautiful uh, early December, about 60 degrees, quite perfect actually. So I'm trying out this uh, Suntory Japanese whiskey, and uh, this has been just catching my eye lately in the liquor store. And um, it's usually over by the scotch section, you know, and it is, as it says on here, um, well, it doesn't actually say it here, but it is like a single malt type of blend, or maybe some of it's blended. I've seen some that say single, you know, single blend or whatever, too. But anyway, so just quick little history on it. They've been making whiskey in Japan for apparently close to 100 years, and um, it's a little bit different with a uh, filter through charcoal bamboo, apparently, which is pretty interesting. I'm just starting to read and learn a little bit about the whole uh, situation. There's not a whole lot on the bottle here, but certainly some other stuff online that you can see about it. Certainly just cool and interesting, and uh, a lot of people renown it as a, uh, a very good whiskey, and it's won a lot of awards recently, not necessarily this particular brand, but some of these Japanese whiskeys. This looked like the most interesting bottle on the shelf to me, and I want to say it was about $45. Which, hey, I'll give it a shot. Um, so cool. Let's open it up and see what we got. Unfortunately, there's people with loud boats on the lake. Go figure. First of all, I'll say it's actually a pretty interesting like fabric uh, type cover on here. Just kinda kinda cool. Screw that cap off. Would have been maybe a little bit cooler if it was a cork, just for fun. I'm not really caring about that though. I just want to take a sip of this whiskey. Let's try it a little bit neat at first. Ah, just barely made it out to the lake today so my light can almost be kind of quick with my light here. But it's good light. Really catch that. Very light in color. Doesn't really bubble up much. I'm no fancy like booze taster with all the fancy words and stuff. I just like to drink cool stuff. So anyway, I'll give it a little sniff. Certainly smells like a, like a good scotch whiskey to me. Has that distinct note right up front. I can't really point out anything else other than maybe just a little bit of the charcoal note on it, which gives it that scotch uh, sensation. And they age it in casks and everything else, you know, so let's give it a sip. Mmm. Huh. Now, if I didn't know this was a Japanese whiskey and you just handed this to me, I would say it's almost got a strong, uh, not quite an Isla uh, scotch, you know, because there's no, I don't think they're filtering it through any peat, I'm not sure, but, but it has a strong flavor like that. Mm. Really good bite and finish, um, definitely has a, almost a cinnamony type of little bit of note to it certainly um just all i can say is that if you handed this to me and didn't tell me it was japanese i would absolutely say it tasted like a very nice scotch mm. ah, i know i'm drinking it out of a hipster wine glass sorry but that's all i had with me today so i'm gonna add just one big fat cube to it, which I also like to do when tasting fine whiskeys or bourbons and scotches and all that good stuff. So, just to open it up a little bit. Give that a little swirl to just open it up a hair. Man, I can't express how beautiful of a day it is on the lake out here. Anyway, 
All right, get in frame there. All right. That definitely opened it up some. I can say I did get a little sweetness, more sweetness on that taste. A little bit more of a caramel taste right in the beginning there. Finishing out nice and good. Um, you know, I'll probably drink a fair amount of this when I get home. I'm not going to get too drunk or anything and drive the boat or my car. But, uh, you know, hopefully it doesn't have a bad hangover because I'm probably going to have two or three of these tonight, I would say. Hmm. Certainly smooth. Absolutely great sipping whiskey. And um and I'd love to maybe try on some friends just some blind taste test against some good scotches and see what they think cuz uh I'm here to tell you that is really good, surprising. I mean, I've seen this stuff on the shelf for a couple of years for sure. Never thought too much about it, but I uh, thought I'd give it a try. Absolutely, this is a good whiskey. You drink this, you know you're drinking a good uh, whiskey that's been aged well. And um, and I, I gotta say, uh, this is definitely gonna be on my shelf from now on. Fantastic little spirit. Anyway, um, what do you think? Have you guys tried this stuff down there? Uh, any opinions? What's the best Japanese uh, whiskey to try if I could possibly afford it or get my hands on it? I would love to try it. Anyway, hit that like button on the video just for the heck of it. Hit the subscribe button if you want to see some more of my uh, quickly shot, poorly produced, but always in fun location, booze and food review videos. And most importantly, have a wonderful day because I sure am. Later.